Today's Thanksgiving Day in the United States, so I've decided to do a special episode. I'm going to share a powerful method of connecting with people. You're going to find it helpful in not only establishing new relationships, but also strengthening the ones you already have. Before I get to that, I want to take a moment to thank you for listening to Red Podcast and being so supportive of me and Laurel during our first 85 episodes. You never really know whether something is going to work or not until you unleash it onto the world, and it's felt great that we've received such an amazing response. One of the most powerful business or personal assets that you can have is your network. As long as you've got a solid network in place, you can lose everything else and still be okay. So I want to help you to build your network, to increase not only the number of people that you know, but also to strengthen your relationships and the connections with the people that you already know. And here's how I suggest that you go about it. First of all, you need to keep in touch with the people that you already know and have communication with them on a regular basis. So how do you do that? The first step is to keep your eyes open for things that will help the people in your network and let those people know about those things. Now, this could be interesting articles that you find, new people to introduce them to, or even something non-business related, even something silly, like a special sale at your favorite retailer. What you reach out with doesn't matter. The only thing that really matters is if it's something that will provide the person that you're reaching out to with value. As today is Thanksgiving, it's worth mentioning that there is a lot of value in a simple thank you note, along with a message of encouragement. This will work to build and strengthen the connections not only with the people that you already know, but also help you build connections with the people that you don't know and want to meet. Your message of thanks doesn't have to be something formal, like something you'd send through the mail. It could be as simple as a quick email that says, Hey, I've really been enjoying your blog post over the last few months. Keep up the good work. Want to go even deeper? If the person you're reaching out to has a book, a podcast, or another product that can be rated on a third-party site such as Amazon or iTunes, Post a public review or post a message via social media networks such as Twitter or Facebook that refers your followers to what you found so helpful. You can then back this up with a personal message to your contact that says something like, hey, I really enjoyed your latest book. It's helped me tremendously. I just left a five-star review for you on Amazon and I'll be recommending it to the people on my mailing list. Either of these things will help you to build new relationships or strengthen the relationships that you already have. This is a very powerful technique. Are you up for a challenge? Do this three times per day. Just a quick message of thanks. And if they've got a product, a podcast, a book, maybe a review. Get into the habit and do it with people you know as well as people that you don't know. That's how networks are built. Thanks for listening to Red Podcast. I hope that you're having a great holiday. I'll see you on the next episode. You've been listening to Red Podcast, real entrepreneur development. Subscribe today using iTunes, Stitcher, or via RSS at redpodcast.com.